Hi, I'm Greg Stokes. I'm a practicing attorney in Atlanta, Georgia. We work on serious injury and death cases. What we're talking about today is the single most important case in Georgia that came from the Supreme Court this year. The case involved injuries to a woman. Uh, there was a case went to trial. There was a verdict. And under the Georgia law, that verdict was reduced down to $350,000. She received her medical bills, she received her lost wages, and she was limited to a recovery of $350,000. This case was very, very important to us because we had a case that was similar. Our, our lady was involved in an automobile accident. She went to the hospital with broken legs. She came out of the hospital with her two arms amputated. Under Georgia law, our client, if she could prove that her care was not the way it should have been at the hospital, she would have been limited to $175,000 for each arm that she lost. And I don't think anyone listening to this would ever feel that would be the right amount of compensation. Well, the Georgia Supreme Court in this earlier case this year looked at the cap on damages on medical malpractice cases. And you know what they concluded? They included, concluded it was absolutely unfair. People in Georgia have a right to a jury trial. And for 200 years, juries have decided what people are entitled to if they're hurt. They found when this law was passed for the benefit of really the medical malpractice insurance carriers, it completely deprived the citizens of Georgia their right to a jury trial. What the Supreme Court reasoned is if the law could restrict people to a recovery of $350,000, well then the law could be written to restrict them down to a limit of $1 for their injuries. Now could you imagine where our client must have sat? She got hurt, her legs were taken care of through some tremendous negligence her arms ended up being amputated, and her trial was coming up in a month or two of this decision, and no substantial offers had been made. Well, I can tell you, after the cap was removed, then the parties were able to get together and seriously discuss how my client would be taken care of in the long run. This case that came down in Georgia was a victory for every citizen in the state. It gave everyone the protection they're entitled to in our civil justice system. If a person is hurt, there's some negligence that causes their injury, they're entitled to the special damages, the lost wages and the medical bills, but they're entitled to a larger figure for what has happened to them, the damage to their body, and that is always to be determined by a jury without any artificial limits being placed on it. I hope no one ever finds themselves in a situation like this. But I can tell you, if you have a problem or you have a situation and you're really concerned about it and you're looking for answers, please give us a call. 1-800-700-5050. We want to concentrate on your problem. Thank you for listening.